100 years of Ohio Stadium. Celebrate a century of the Kshu. Ohio Stadium history. The Kshu's most significant moments. 1919, the house that Harley built. The inadequacy of Ohio Field, located at 17th Avenue and High Street, was magnified and interest in Ohio State football soared as record numbers of fans turned out to watch dazzling All-American, chic, Harley play. Discussions for a new stadium heat up. 1919-1920, stadium fundraising campaign launched. This was a landmark year for Ohio State football. Interest in the program was soaring, and an extensive stadium fundraising campaign was launched in the fall with a goal of reaching $600,000, a total that many felt was unrealistic. 1921, Breaking Ground and Construction Ohio Governor Harry Davis joined a crowd of over 2,500 to officially break ground on the massive new stadium. There was criticism because of its capacity of over 60,000, but interest was great, more than $1 million toward the cost had now been pledged by dedicated Ohio State fans. 1922, Ohio Stadium opens. Ohio Stadium, a double-decked, horseshoe-shaped structure that earned architect Howard Dwight Smith the American Institute of Architects' top award for excellence in public works, opened on October 7 with a 5-0 Ohio State victory over Ohio Wesleyan before 25,000 fans. 1922, 72,000 fans at Dedication Game. The Ohio Stadium Dedication Game came against Michigan on October 21. It was a wonderful day for Ohio State despite the final score. The stadium was packed. Every seat was filled, as were temporary stands set up in the south end, and the crowd was estimated at 72,500. 1925, Red Grange's final game. The final college game of legendary Illinois halfback Harold Red Grange was on November 21, 1925 in Ohio Stadium. The 84,295 in attendance was, at the time, the largest crowd to attend a sporting event in this country. 1926, first 100,000 crowd. Per the Lantern Attendance at the Ohio State-Michigan game officially estimated at 90,411 but, no one actually knows how many frenzied fans saw Michigan nose out the Ohioans 17-16 in one of the greatest games of modern football. 1928, commencement held in Ohio Stadium. The first graduation ceremony to be celebrated inside Ohio Stadium was held for the spring 1928 graduating class on June 1. President William Oxley Thompson delivered the commencement address. 1928, first win over Michigan. In Ohio Stadium Buckeyes prevailed 19-7 in front of 72,496 in attendance. Athletics Director L.W. St. John announced all stadium debt has been paid off. 1928, ramp entrance debuts. The traditional Ohio State Marching Band ramp entrance was first performed at Ohio Stadium in 1928. Very little has changed in the nearly 100 years since. Approximately 20 minutes before kickoff, the percussion section is first to enter the stadium to Buckeye Battle Cry. 1933, Stadium Living. From 1933 to 1999 select Ohio State students lived in the Ohio Stadium dorms. The initial group of 75 in 1933 was all male. In the 1980s a renovation bumped the residents to more than 360 men and women. 1934, Buckeye Grove A wonderful and unique tradition of Ohio State football began in 1934, the awarding of a Buckeye tree to Ohio State's first-team All-American players. The trees are planted in Buckeye Grove, adjacent and to the southwest of Ohio Stadium. 1935, the game of the century. Unbeaten Notre Dame defeated unbeaten Ohio State, 18-13, at Ohio Stadium in what was described at the time as the greatest college game ever played. Ohio State led 13-0 entering the fourth quarter, but ND scored twice in the final two minutes to play to win. 1935-1936, the Buckeye Bullet. 
One of Ohio State's and America's most cherished athletes, Jesse Owens competed on the Ohio Stadium track from 1934 to 36. He won eight NCAA titles, but will forever be remembered for winning four gold medals at the 1936 Berlin Olympic Games. 1936, Script Ohio Debuts Script Ohio, one of the greatest traditions in all of college football, was first performed on October 10, 1936 in Ohio Stadium. Each time the Ohio State Marching Band performs Script Ohio, a fourth or fifth year sousaphone player is chosen to dot the I in Ohio. 1938, Block O is founded. Block O, the official student section of Ohio State Athletics, has cheering sections in the north and south end zones at Ohio Stadium. Originated in 1938, Block O supports Ohio State student athletes and upholds the spirit and tradition of Ohio State University. 1950, Ohio Stadium Theater Ohio Stadium Theater was located at Gate 10 of the CHU. Sponsored by the College of Arts, the project served as the stage for summer productions and plays. 1950, The Snow Bowl On November 25, 1950, Ohio State and Michigan engage in a uniquely remembered game at Ohio Stadium, the Snow Bowl. An early winter storm hit Columbus with heavy snow, 28 miles per hour winds and temps in the teens. 1951, Enter Wayne Woodrow Hayes The Ohio State Board of Trustees, in a special meeting held February 18, 1951, approved Woody Hayes as Ohio State's new football coach. Hayes would win 205 games, 13 Big Ten titles and four national championships over the next 27 years. 1954, The Sweet Sound of Victory The sound of the victory bell, located in the southeast tower of Ohio Stadium, was first heard after Ohio State defeated California on October 2. The bell weighs 2,420 pounds and can be heard five miles away. 1957, Iowa win Keys national title. A huge crowd of 82,935, including Vice President Richard M. Nixon, was on hand to see No. 6 Ohio State defeat No. 5 Iowa, 17-13, in one of the great games at Ohio Stadium. 1965, Brutus debuts. Ohio State students Ray Buries and Sally Huber suggested a Buckeye as Ohio State's mascot. Brutus debuted in October in a large papier-mâché costume but was replaced two weeks later by a fiberglass version. 1971, AstroTurf installed in Ohio Stadium. Ohio Stadium's grass field was removed and AstroTurf was installed. A $380,000 gift from Lou Fisher was made for the turf in the memory of friend and Buckeye teammate Joe Campanella. 1971, Neil Armstrong Commencement Address The first man to walk on the moon and native of Wapakoneta, Ohio, delivered the commencement speech at Ohio Stadium to the spring class of 1971. Four former presidents have also given the commencement address in the Shu, Obama, 13, Clinton, 07, George W. Bush, 02, and George H. W. Bush, 1983. 1972, Introducing Archie Griffin Archie Griffin's first official carry came against North Carolina, in week two, and by game's end he had set the single-game rushing record with 239 yards. 1974, On the National Register in March of 1974 Ohio Stadium became the first football stadium to be officially listed on the National Register of Historic Places. 1983, Honoring Jesse Owens Jesse Owens Plaza, located outside of the north end of Ohio Stadium, was completed in September of 1982 at a cost of $400,000. 1985, 38 Olympians in Ohio Stadium by 1985, the Jesse Owens Classic had become recognized as one of the top track and field events in the country. The 1985 Classic featured 38 Olympians competing. 1985, First Collegiate Night Game. 
Ohio Stadium had used portable lights several times to complete late afternoon starts, but the 1985 season opener versus Pitt was the first true collegiate night game in stadium history. 1988, Pink Floyd Rocks the Shoe Pink Floyd was the first rock concert at Ohio Stadium, playing in front of nearly 64,000 on May 28, 1988. 1989, 100th year of college football Ohio State celebrates its 100th year of competition in collegiate football. 1990, grassroots are back. After 19 years and two different artificial turf surfaces, the field at Ohio Stadium returned to natural grass for the 1990 Ohio State football season. 1991, South Stand's expansion adds 5,700 seats. For the third time in Ohio Stadium's history, seating in the South Stands was expanded. An additional 5,700 South Stand seats increased the capacity there from 7,800 to 13,500. 1995, rivalry renewed. An Ohio Stadium record crowd of 95,537 watched Ohio State come from behind to defeat Notre Dame, 45-26, in the Irish's first visit to Ohio Stadium in 60 years. 1996, Major League Soccer at Ohio Stadium. The brand new professional soccer league, Major League Soccer, included the Columbus Crew, which played its first three seasons of games at Ohio Stadium. 1997, the Rolling Stones at Ohio Stadium. Iconic rock band plays Ohio Stadium for the first time. They would return in 2015 to a sold-out show. 1999, welcoming the George Strait Country Music Festival. Check out the advertisement for the 1999 George Strait Country Music Festival, which featured acts such as Tim McGraw, Faith Hill, Asleep at the Wheel, and more. 1999, number 45 retired. Archie Griffin's number 45 jersey was retired at the October 30th homecoming game versus Iowa. Griffin's was the first to be retired. 2001 A New Shoe A major three-year renovation to Ohio Stadium was completed at a cost of $194 million. Work included removing the track, lowering the field, adding AA deck, a CC deck addition, renovating concourses, permanent south stands, a new scoreboard and press box, and adding suites. 2001, a gift of glass. The Ohio Stadium Rotunda was decorated with three opalescent stained glass panels, each approximately 18.5 feet high and 12 feet wide, during the major renovation project. 2001, 9-11 Memorial Service. Following the September 11th terrorist attacks, a memorial service was held in Ohio Stadium. 2006, Number 1 versus Number 2 One of the greatest games in Ohio Stadium history took place on November 18, Number 1 Ohio State versus Number 2 Michigan. Ohio State won, 42-39, to clinch its first outright Big Ten championship since 1984. 2007, Artificial Turf Returns Ohio State replaced its natural grass playing surface in Ohio Stadium after 17 seasons of use by installing a new field turf surface. 2010, NCAA lacrosse attendance record. An NCAA record crowd, regular season, on campus, of 31,078 fans watched Ohio State's men's lacrosse team defeat Air Force at Ohio Stadium. 2014, Let There Be Lights. A $13.7 million renovation to 92-year-old Ohio Stadium includes a new field turf playing surface, 2,522 additional seats in the south stands, concrete waterproofing and permanent lights. Capacity is now at an all-time high of 104,581. 2015, Rolling Stones reignite the shoe. Ohio Stadium's role as a concert venue gets a jumpstart with the return of the Rolling Stones and the inaugural Buckeye Country Superfest in 2015, marking an end to a 12-year hiatus of shows at the Shoe. 2016, the all-time record crowd, 
110,045. Ohio State defeated Michigan, 30-27, in double overtime in front of a record Ohio Stadium crowd of 110,045 fans. 2016, largest soccer crowd in Ohio history. The largest soccer crowd ever in Ohio, 86,641, packed Ohio Stadium on August 11, 2016 to watch Paris Saint-Germain defeat Real Madrid, 3-1. 2020, season attendance, 3,244. The coronavirus pandemic ravaged 2020 football season had a reduced number of games that were played before limited numbers of fans. 2021, Buckeyes ride Henderson's record day. Freshman running back Trayvon Henderson broke Archie Griffin's freshman and single-game rushing records with 277 yards in a 41-20 win over Tulsa September 18. 2022, Ohio Stadium 100. More than 50 million fans have attended games at Ohio Stadium. The Department of Athletics and The Ohio State University celebrate 100 years of Ohio Stadium throughout the course of the 2022 calendar year.